Hello everyone, uh, welcome back. So today we'll be talking about AWS Identity and Access Management and what are IAM users and how to identify them and various access methods. So let's go ahead and start. So what are IAM users? So an IAM user is an identity or a profile that you create within an AWS or Amazon Web Services system. So think of a virtual representation of a person or a workload that interacts with the AWS services. So that is the basic definition of IAM user. So let's go ahead and see how to identify the IAM user. So coming to the first one, it's a friendly name. It can be used such as Richard or Ravi. So these friendly names can be used. Coming to the second one, it's Amazon uh, resource name, or in short, we can call it as ARN can be used uh, to IAM user. So basically coming to the definition of ARN, an ARN in AWS is a unique identifier for the resource within the AWS ecosystem. So it represents uh, or it acts as a naming convention for uh, different AWS resources such as EC2 instance, S3 buckets, or IAM users. So in this case, we can use it as for IAM users. Coming to the third one, it's a unique identifier for IAM user can be used. So this ID is returned only when you use uh, the API tools for uh, Windows Partial or uh, AWS CLI to create these IAM users. So that is how we can identify these IAM users. Now let's explore uh, various access methods to AWS based on the IAM credentials. So coming to the first one, it's a console password. So password that uh, IAM user can type in uh, to sign into these interactive sessions such as uh, AWS uh, Management Console. Coming to the second one, it's access keys, so which is used to make programmatical calls to this AWS. Coming to the third one, it's uh, SSH keys for use with the uh, code commit, a secure and a convenient way to authenticate and uh, access your uh, code commit repositories. Coming to the fourth one, it's a server certificates like SL and TSL certificates that you can use to authenticate with some uh, AWS services. And in this case, AWS recommends uh, AWS certificate manager for this. So that's it for now. And all this information has been uh, taken from these uh, docs. So coming to this video, I hope you guys understood the concept of today's video. Uh, coming to the next videos, I'll be uh, doing some practical labs on this so that uh, you can understand more like what is this IAM users and these groups. So that's it for now. Thank you. And if you like the video, please click the like below. And if you're not subscribed to my channel, please do subscribe to my channel and please share the video. Thanks everyone.